the greatest weapon we have in this world is music. We are passing on the information. We are passing out the message. But the message is useless unless you take action. We want you to come out with the music you have in you and make it heard by everyone. Because it is that message that you're sitting on that is going to transform somebody's life.
Music is a universal language to all. And you see the moods of people changing according to the music going on. The very best is in me, SL, and Johan. We were working with Tam um, in his studio with lots of sort of craziness going on. <laughs> actually all inspires more creativity. Tam had an idea for this, for his lyrics, um, and that sort of started coming together. And Johan had recorded some cool things, so we started getting the beat together. Um, and it all, it all aligned eventually in such a, such a brilliant way um, and created something new that none of us would have been able to do individually. <laughs> When 
when the kids learned the song and sang it for the first time, I was beaming from ear to ear. It was such a special thing. Again, these kids, you know, they're just walking past us. They learned the lyrics, um, learned the melody, could sing it very well, and also with their own swagger. <laughs> Tim DeLauder, singer for the Polyphonic Spree. We're here to work with the Gulu High Choir and reshape one of our songs by adding some of their flavor to it. I want to try to improvise musically with them to see where it goes. Check this one one more time. Okay. So now go up from there. So is that, is that Ray? Do, Ray. Is that supposed to be Ray? Ray. Is that me or fa? Me. That's me? Alright, so... Me. Yeah, there you go. Yes. Okay. I hope that us coming here um, enlightens the people within my group to realize the power of music and the significance of it, and but also the people that are here that might not have known um, that we've all got as human beings, that we can all like and become one under the umbrella of music. from one state of being to another. Yeah. Like an uncut diamond turns into something good. Yeah. <laughs> And then into the B section. Maybe you just start singing there and then straight away, yeah. Oi, mate! Oi, mate! Yeah. Oh, you mate. Oh, mate. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Try the legs.
Little rock cut diamond, a little boy from London. Oi, mate! How do you dance when you're crossing over the sea? Well, you were made in London, a little bit from Kenya. Jumbo! Trying to find out where I gotta be. Be complete. Being good. Good. Change. Change for me. Change for you. One day, this chap called the Northern King, I don't know what his real name is, but the Northern King's a pretty bad boy name. Um, I love it. He came in and he had this little Ricky Ricky thing. It's like a single string instrument, which is kind of plays a bit like a violin. Thank you. I'll leave it to the professional. It was homemade, and when he played it, it was absolutely beautiful. It sounded a bit like a violin, but, and again, single string, so very, every little minute movement of the hand it would pick up, and um, it, was fa it was really, really cool. When the song really started coming together, it was brilliant because it seemed initially like it may be a bit of a struggle, not necessarily because of you know language or anything like that, but whenever you start a song from scratch, you kind of need a bit of a spark, a bit of magic to to happen, you know. Okay. Right now, okay. Is this sound is so. It sounds great. Thank yeah. You. Thank you. This is sounding too good to, to start. And you, 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 you all need to do it together. One at a time, probably. No, no, no. This that's what's making it so cool. The fact that you're all singing it together like that. Try to think. Yeah. What does it sound like? Anything in Chichera? Um. Well, I never thought of it. I have to figure it out. That's how you write a hit song. You make up some, some nonsense and you try to figure out what words can well, fit in it. Well, we said about today going through a struggle, coming out of the struggle, going through water. Waiting. That's actually work. It's like time has come for change. Okay. Oh, all right. Let's go with that. Then. What is it? How do you say it? <laughs> That's it. And again? Should we write it down? Yeah, yeah. Maybe you can help. Yes, let's jump. What, what, what does it mean in itself? Like it's, it's, time it's time for change. change. Yeah. It was great working with SL and Tam in the studio because both were working in different, you know, uh, different languages. But we all came to this great agreement. The song is about um, it's about striving for a better future, um, and you know everybody's journey. Uh, it just sort of naturally came out. These are things that'll stick with me forever. I learned a great deal. I experienced a great deal. I was humbled and I was inspired. So used to having this big band behind me, but had all these beautiful voices, which was great. Yeah. the 
time. He's walking along with a soul in his lungs. Amazing. Know that the spades are the swords of a soldier. Know that the clubs are weapons of war. Know that diamonds mean money for the song. That's not the ship of mine. That's not the shape, shape of my heart. was it was expanding <laughs> it just broadened my horizons I'm a pretty open guy and you know again I had been to Africa before so I thought I knew what I was gonna get um, but my goodness this was something unique and I feel lucky every single day a that I get to make music for a living um, but B that I got to experience something like that um, it's a once-in-a-lifetime experience and I, you know it can never be repeated